A morning tradition for many schools has gone high tech in Amherst. News 4's Melissa Holmes shows us how a middle school has acquired a global audience. Good morning, Amherst Middle School. This is Alex and Carly with today's news. It's not your old fashioned morning announcements over the PA system. It's an extracurricular TV tech club that produces a daily morning news program. The Amherst Middle School students literally run the show. You have attendance, microphones, director, audio mixer, computer, and producer. The fact that the senior level producers are in charge. Are we all set? And it's a student run show really makes them feel more confident, like they're capable of doing anything. Technology teacher Rob Strzeski built the two-room studio from the ground up and found an inexpensive and easy-to-use software program to create the show. We have a, a bunch of virtual sets where they're totally computer-generated graphics. The coolest feature is the green screen feature and the built-in teleprompter. So here you can see the students doing the news live, but let me take you across the hall. This is where all of the homerooms in the middle school watch the announcements live. But now this is not just seen in the middle school, it can also be seen globally thanks to SchoolTube.com. Log on to SchoolTube.com and you'll find not only Amherst Morning News, but also study tips, music videos, and even election news made by students for students. Unlike YouTube, where anybody can upload anything at any time, SchoolTube is fully moderated. I think YouTube has stupid stuff on it. SchoolTube is like videos that are made by students. And SchoolTube has made Amherst Tech TV a model for news programs in other schools. It's unbelievable the emails that we get, um, not just from within the United States, but from Australia, from Europe. It actually makes me feel pretty good. From homerooms to the World Wide Web, these morning announcements really are grabbing attention. And we are clear. Melissa Holmes, News 4. That's great. Some guys here want to apply for a job there, Don. I don't know if they have any meteorologists on staff, though. Well, I don't know. They have the green wall, though. They have, they half, have of, half of what we need, like this thing here. And that, you see that that boy had a shirt with green stripes on it. I wonder if it was what we would call key out, where sometimes you see odd colors. It's because I picked the wrong tie. A little inside tip. You know, when I was in college, they didn't have any. It's Marconi was still working at with the vacuum tubes, where these kids are now. Well, we're driving.